<clears throat> Hi, everyone, and welcome to TWF SmackDown Live. I'm here with Sander Harris and Corey Graves. And today we have, we got Shane Kamiki here. Well, today Shane Kamiki said it's not a good day. Now I have to do the sad duty of bringing out Velasca and Kevin Owens, who apparently want to say some words. Apparently they claim that they've been wrongly fired and that, that their actions, even though they say that they say that they um, their actions would be considered would con, can be considered outlawed. They claim they're in the right. Please welcome, bring out Belaska and Kevin Owens. Well, now, Xander Harris said, now, what is Belaska and Kevin Owens? What excuses can they give for their behavior? Well, Corey Graves said, you know what Ernest P. Worrell did to them, and you know all the stuff that Pee Wee Herman's done to them. Yeah, well, so, first off, we're here to tell you that we think what Pee Wee Herman did to us was wrong. What Ernest P. Worrell's been doing to us is wrong. And we think, Shane Kamiki, you need to bring us back. Oh, I need to bring you back. Hmm. Let's see about that, Shane Kamiki says. When you attacked Commissioner Ernest P. Worrell, when you attacked General Manager Pee Wee Herman, well... I don't think that I should be bringing you back, you know. And as far as the chairwoman and owner, Zena, and chief executive officer, Ric Flair, is concerned, they gave me the power and put me in charge until Pee Wee Herman comes back and until Ernest P. Worrell comes back. But since Ernest P. War was taken to leave of absence as commissioner, it will only be until Pee Wee Herman comes back. So you two claim you lawyered up, but I do not see no lawyer, okay? But I'm here to tell you, if you think you lawyered up, how come I don't see no lawyer? Well, that was just the ploy, you know. That was just the ploy to get so we could come in and talk. We all know how all you all are so scared. You know, you know how you're all so scared of us. You know. And you know that anytime <coughs> a business hears the word lawsuit, they get all scared. Well, maybe that's true. Because lawsuits aren't good. But obviously, no lawyer in their right mind could sit there and they could say, Hey, look, well, my client was being bullied by Commissioner Ernest P. Worrell and General Manager Pee Wee Herman. Oh, they had the right to beat them up. And that's pushing it a bit because bullying isn't even what it was. But, of course, that's what your lawyer would say if you actually did lawyer up. Which we all know you actually didn't. So, if you say you want your job back, and I don't think you should get your job back, but, hey, I'm believing in giving you chances. You know? But at the end of the day, it is what it is. So, here's what we're going to do. Since you two think you're the shit, and you two think that you can do whatever you want, and that there's a double standard, well, the only double standard that I'm going to give you well, obviously there will be no stand here. Well, Velasca says that's good to know there are no standards. This is exactly what were you going to do to us? Well, hold on. 
I'm trying to think of what I could do to you. I'm trying to think what I could actually, in my power, of what I can actually do. And I'm thinking, why not? People are going to complain anyway. But I'm thinking... I'm thinking about having you, one of you both. I'm gonna have you, one of you two, burst Braun Strowman. That's not right. Now, who, where's the referee at for this match? Well, we don't know where the referee went. So that's why we've been having, you know, other referees fill in. Yeah. You know, that's why we've been having other referees fill in, unfortunately. You know, Dean well, Jamie Noble, road agent, going to be filling in as, as a referee here for this match. Oh! And I guess Velasca says it's going to be Kevin Owens that's going to... Uh, You know, it's going to be fighting. And now Kevin Owens going, this isn't fair. Corey Graves says Shane and Mickey should just, just give their job back to them. Well, wouldn't that be fair? Award bad behavior, Xander Harris says. Xander, you weren't bullied like they were. Oh, and Braun Strowman just, you know, is taking down uh, Kevin Owens right now who obviously believes in his head, him and Belaska both, that they are bullied, that they're victims. And that, oh, they should have the, and that they should have the right to, that they should have the right to beat anybody up. You know, Well, they should. Oh, and that kick didn't do nothing to Braun Strowman. He got, he got Kevin Owens up, and he's getting ready to beat him here. And we better hope that Jamie, we better hope Jamie Noble gets ready to do the one, two, three here. Well, he's getting himself in position to do it. One, two, three. Oh, too late. Ding, ding, ding. Like, too late. Eating. Here is your winner. You know, here is your winner. Braun Strowman. Oh. And Velasca tried to come in and do something to Braun Strowman. And looks like whatever. Like, whatever it was. Lucretia. Lucretia. Lucretia, Lucretia, Lucretia. Um, didn't quite work out. Well, Xander Harris said, I guess Kevin Owens and Velasca ain't going to get their jobs back. You know, but what they did get was getting beat up by Braun Strowman. That's real funny, Corey Graves said. That's real funny. Kevin Owens, how, how would you comment? How would I comment? First, I can't even stand up right in this ring. And number two, I thought Shane Kamiki would be on our side. You know, but turns out he's not on our side. And it also turns out that he's just as bad as Ernest P. Worrell and Pee Wee Herman are. Velasca, you care to say anything? Yeah, I agree with Kevin Owens. I think that that Shane Kamiki is nothing more than just abusing his power like Ernest P. Worrell and Pee Wee Herman did. That's all I'm going to say there. You can get out of here now. Well, that's their opinion, I guess. That's their win, and I guess they are entitled to it. 
But at the end of the day, it is what it is. Braun Strowman defeats Kevin Owens. And even though Velasco and Kevin Owens can can say whatever they want to say at the end, that's their right to say what they want to say at that point. They still lost. Yeah, and I think Shane Kamiki's starting to do the same thing Ernest P. Worrell and Pee Wee Herman did. Well, it might be true, Xander Harrison. might be true. But remember, Kevin Owens and Velasco brought on themselves, Xander Harrison. Well, you're right about that. It was Velasco and Kevin Owens that did bring it on themselves. They did start this. Well, it looks like that's all the time we got here for TWS SmackDown Live. For Dwayne McAllen, Xander Harris, and Corey Graves, we'll see you tomorrow for NXT.